What's up, YouTube? Social Notes Best Junior here, aka Justin, here along with Wiretux. And today I'm going to show you how to uh, basically reset your Mac OS X dock. Now, as soon as this Mac App Store thing came out here, everything after Activity Monitor has been downloaded with the exceptions of Dreamweaver and some of the photo booth and uh, regular Mac applications. When it comes down to it, this video is finally going to help me reset my own dock and organize my desktop of this wonderful thing. I took a screenshot of it, you know, oops, in case I ever need to get back to it, but yeah, that's that. So in order to reset uh, the dock, I previously made a video right here, Cap Computer, if you're a long time subscriber, you might know, but uh, people were complaining about this little screaming in the background. So um, I'm redoing it, directions are in this, none of the same, I'm just redoing the video. So um, we'll need to go into Finder and go to your profile. So you'll go to Macintosh HD, Users, Your Profile, the Home Folder, the Library. If you know a shortcut, use that shortcut to get to your Library or Home Folder. And then we'll click and open up the Folder Preferences. In this folder, there's something called com.apple.doc.plist. Com dot apple dot doc dot p list we search for that we click on the preferences thing and guess what it displays all our doc applications so i'm going to copy that and paste it there then i'm going to trash it so basically i have a backup of the doc and then i'm just going to trash the doc folder empty the trash okay continue now I need to open up and go into Spotlight and search for Terminal. In Terminal, I'm going to say Kill All Doc. Or Capitalize the D in Doc. Kill All Capital D. It's going to reset the doc. And voila, I have a brand new Macintosh doc with um, Terminal, Chrome, ScreenFlow, and TextEdit. As those are the four apps that are being opened. Now, how do we get back our old doc? If you copy that old file and it's on your desktop, just copy it back, open up Finder, go back into your library, go back into Preferences, search for that file again, apple.doc.plist, go to Preferences, trash this one, empty it, press OK if you have any apps that are being on hand, and then Go back to preferences and paste your old file. Now what we'll do is go back into terminal and kill all capital D O C or C O K. And guess what? My doc comes back. Yay, so I'm not really gonna rearrange it because I don't feel like it. Sorry guys, you'll have to deal with the messy screenshots in the doc for a while. But that's how you reset your Mac OS 10 doc. Directions are in the description. Sorry about this last video. I did get a comment by uh, I don't want to pronounce this name wrong, but um, they wanted me to redo this. Wanted me to redo the screaming video. So um, yeah, there you go. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Found it useful. Fourteen thousand views. That's the most views I've ever got on one video, probably. <laughs> but I will see you guys later. Peace.